Greetings fellow tinkerers and hackers. Here is a overview of my progress with the ESP8266 microcontroller and I am using the ESP-01 flavor of it. I am controlling this bipolar stepping motor barely as the size of a dime using two control lines, GPIO lines, coming out of the uh, ESP-01. You can see here the motor and on the top top left corner of the screen there's a, uh, a uh, stepping motor controller, a double H bridge. I can control it to uh, turn uh, forward, backward, and to stop by issuing com commands from a web browser. Here you can see it turning counterclockwise and then stop. Here's the uh, ESP01, and then in the middle there was the uh, USB adapter. Then the chip that we could see briefly was a 14015 serial to parallel converter. And I essentially send the phase data in serial mode to that chip and that chip will translate that into four parallel uh, signals that contain the phase information. The chip has up to as uh, eight output lines so in theory I could even control two stepping motors but I didn't uh, get that far yet. So right now uh, the Wi-Fi a receiver will pick up the information that I send using a web browser and uh, take a parameter and interpret it as a RPM value. So the way I wired it, if I have a positive number it goes counterclockwise, a negative number will go uh, clockwise and zero will stop. You can see here the scope trace of one of the phases and as the serial to parallel converter swaps from one phase to the other you can see uh, very briefly a little spike that corresponds to the uh, phases being swapped over. It's too fast for the motor to react to that. This is the programming button and then the reset. So you can see the motor turning. At this point the USB connection is no longer required. It's receiving its commands from the Wi-Fi channel. This is the uh, MC14015 serial to parallel converter that is taking the uh, ESP01 signal and s distributing the signals to the four phases. I use GPIO0 for data. This is the uh, ESP01. And GPIO2 for the clock signal. Sending the data to the stepping motor controller. And this is the stepping motor doing its thing. Here you can see in the uh, web browser address line, I enter. Uh, no, that's not it. Sorry. 
I enter the URL 192.168.10.15 and then followed by slash question mark and then the parameter which is the RPM and then the motor will react to that and turn uh, clockwise, counterclockwise or stop. Because of the scan rate of the camera the image is a little bit uh, erratic but in reality it's turning very smoothly. I noticed also that if I run that motor at very slow step rate it tends to get incredibly hot uh, because essentially although it's running on 5 volts those the phases have a rather low impedance 10 ohms or so so now with a negative number it's turning clockwise. I want to experiment with that little motor and come up with a uh, linear drive that would be very compact and but potentially uh, very strong and insanely precise because uh, I could drive a uh, 0.5 millimeter pitch screw Thanks for watching.